Hello friends, my name is Virain Thakur and welcome to my channel Easy English by Virain Thakur. Today we are going to talk about introducing personal experiences in your IELTS exam. Yes, it's quite pivotal to know how we have to use our personal experiences in IELTS exam and uh, expression of that is very important. Let's talk about some important features of this particular segment which is important in IELTS exam. In your IELTS exam, talking about your experiences is what speaking part one is all about. Yes, when we talk about speaking part one, it is quite pivotal to share your experiences about any given topic. Speaking part two will also be based on your personal experiences. You should not start every sentence with same phrase, otherwise it will become monotonous and boring, one can say. Here are some phrases you can use to vary your language when introducing personal experiences. So here are some phrases that you can use while you share your experiences. In my experience, it is quite pivotal for us to know about IELTS exam. This is what you can use as a phrase when you start any sentence or when you share your experience. The next one is I remember when that was quite important for us to know. What happened was unbelievable for me. You can also start in that way. The next one is one time that was quite important for us to know what or you can also use in this way one time when it was raining then I felt that I must have brought an umbrella so next one is back when I was 16 back when I was playing with my schoolmates so in that way you can express your personal experiences whether those experiences are related to past time or present time. So it's quite pivotal for us to know about the significance of using personal experiences with the help of some phrases which are good and important and suitable as per the situation given. So, I hope this video will be quite helpful for you to know how to use some phrases to introduce yourself about personal experiences. So, when you want to introduce your personal experiences on the given topics, then you have to use such kind of phrases so that you can make an impact and you can use the language in a suitable manner so thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel easy english by virain thakur and share it with your friends as well we'll definitely meet with a new video so till then stay tuned keep watching easy english by virain thakur